This is not really my story, but this is a story from my friend Jack Scarangella, who's a very close friend of mine. And um, he's a drummer. We have the same birthday, but he's 11 years younger. Doesn't make him bad. <laughs> he's just younger. And he's in New York. And um, we've played together. He, uh, I played on his album, uh, The Hero in Us All. That's, uh, you can see that on my website. You can see it on his website. And um, he told me about the story. I wrote a song called Shells. Jack told me that as a kid, he was fascinated by the shape and colors and formation of rocks and seashells. He has a collection of rocks at home, but just a few of them, real special ones uh, that have meaning for him. So one summer, he really needed a vacation. He went out um, to one of the vacation spots out in Long Island. He's on the beach. He goes out into the water. He's swimming. And after about 40 minutes, and he's searching for shells or rocks, so he comes up with this, with his hand, with this beautiful shell in his hand. And he's kind of far out from the beach, and he jumps out of the water, kind of, and he throws the shell to shore. And then this kid, this little boy, comes walking by on the, on the shore with her mom, with his mom. And he starts jumping up with excitement, with a big smile on his face, because... He found this shell, this beautiful shell that Jack just threw on the beach. And Jack's screaming into the wind because he's too far away. He's going, no, no, that's, that's my shell. And being that he was too far away, it got lost in the wind. So the boy's happiness, seeing this, Jack decided to just let it go. And jo Jack thought, well, enjoy it. You got a great shell, little guy. Jack felt he'd never find a sh uh, another shell like that as the kid walked away with his mom. But he hoped he might anyway. He dove back in the water with his hand clutched. To his surprise, he came up from the water with this beautiful big shell. This was even better than the other shell he found. It had colors and stars and like the universe on it. It was unbelievable. And um, so Jack's thinking, here's a beautiful gift, <laughs> you know, after he just gave away something he didn't really want to give away. So this the little story about this is about love. There's a lot of wisdom and love contained in here. The point is, I feel, if you're willing to give something away that's of value to yourself with love in your heart, life will give you something greater. It all has to do with surrendering, letting go. So even though it's not my story, I thought it was very beautiful.